Hey everybody, Beneza again. Um, this is a New York Knicks mail day number two. Unfortunately, um, I've done the video a couple of times, so I've unboxed it um, already. My wife called twice and interrupted me, so that's the box that came in. Unfortunately, no New York lo uh, New York Knicks logo on it, but uh, if you see from the first one, I've got three of pretty much everything. Um, uh, I've got three drawstring bags, three scarves. Don't know what I'm going to do with three scarves in uh, Florida, let alone one. But thank you anyway, because they could have sent pocket schedules. And why would you send two pocket schedules um, of the previous season? Um, three caps, three lanyards, and that was it. Like, like, I should expect more. Uh, but this time around, they sent t-shirts instead of scarves um, and pins. Only got two pins, I guess. One got lost and they couldn't be bothered to find it. Anyway, these are the caps. They're the, what I would say, bog standard ones that, you know, you might see someone elderly wear or a little child who, you know, I want a cap, I want a cap, and the grandpa, granddad has bought them the same one, and granddad's still cool because the child's still only four years old. Um, anyway, New York Knicks t-shirts. Uh, you've got two extra large, one medium, uh, I guess one for me and one for my wife and one for our son. Um, the extra large t-shirts will fit my my son and my wife, medium certainly not going to fit any of it, any of us, especially me. Uh, maybe if I sew all three of them together, that it, 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 they might fit. Um, but that's the teach got so three of everything: three t-shirts, three drawstring bags. Uh, the drawstring there. Uh, these three yan yan lids lan. Yet, put uh, your keys and possibly your ID on there for school and or work. Uh, New York Knicks stickers and these little New York Knicks pins. Um, so all in all, yet again, New York Knicks, in my opinion, hit it out of the park because they could have sent some player cards some player cards and some pocket schedules. Some teams send two of the previous season or the season they were already in and it's already three quarters of the way through. Um, yes, people do collect pocket schedules. Don't know why, but I guess you've got to collect something like stamps or coins or trading cards or fan mail bait. No. Mail day packs like I do. Uh, it's a bit of a hobby for me. Uh, the Knicks aren't my team in terms of NBA. Um, my team's the Chicago Bulls. So to get all this stuff from the Knicks, why is he emailing the Knicks for? Well, it's, a, it's part of the the hobby. You know, email as many teams as I can as often as I can um, and hope that they mail something out. You know, I'm still emailing six teams who religiously because I religiously email them, religiously tell me, go away, leave us alone, you're not getting anything. Um, most of all, the Detroit Lions, who, because you don't live in Michigan, we're not going to give you anything. So I'm going to keep going and going and going until they hopefully one day give in and send me a pocket schedule. <laughs> so, no, that's not good enough. I'm going to keep going. Um, but thank you, New York Knicks. For all that stuff. Um, I did get another Chicago Bulls one yesterday. But again it had the. Uh, it had the. 2015-2016 um, season yearbook. Um, and only one sticker this time. They sent me three last time I think. So. Um, it doesn't really count to me. Because um, Derek Rose. Is gone. 
he's at, as he, most New York Knicks fans is now at New York Knicks. Um, I think Joachim Noah's disappeared f- through free agency. Um, I guess they, they got fed up with his big mouth, I guess. Um, I don't know. But, you know, uh, got the thank you letter, but I'm not really too worried about the thank you letter um, from any team. But, you know, being from Pitt, you know, my dad's side of the family being from Pittsburgh, we like the Steelers, Penguins and Pirates. Penguins are sent two autographs of Malkin and Crosby. Um, Steelers sent the yearbook. I don't like the yearbook, so I personally wouldn't collect them. Um, like the pocket schedules, because, you know, you're going to need a bookshelf to want to, you know, not that having a bookshelf is ba- particularly bad, um, but I'm not going to go out and buy every year book from now until the day I die. I'm not even going to buy one unless I know that I'm in Chicago and I can get to players to get them to autograph it. Um, but anyway, that was the New York Knicks mail day before I go on too long because I have a habit of sitting here and 20 minutes later, you know, blah, 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 yeah. and everybody's like, what? So anyway, um, that was the New York Knicks mail day. Three t-shirts. Again, the, the three drawstring string bags, three caps, lanyards, stickers, two pins, you nailed it, New York Knicks. That's to me, is what a fan pack should be, you know, and I guess I emailed them a second time at some point and this lady who made contact with me last time has been kind enough to say, yeah, okay, we'll send you some more stuff. Because she emailed me and she said, well, we'll send you the same stuff as we did in June. I said, well, okay, send send it. But she, fortunately enough, she, she changed out the scarves to T-shirts. So, because I don't know what I'm going to do with the free scarves in Florida. Even if I do have New Yorkers buy them, you know, they have to be on vacation here. I would think from New York to buy them, I think, or somewhere else where it's cold. So, excuse me, the the T-shirts is a better option. More so being from Florida or in Florida. I'm not from Florida, I'm from England. But anyway, um, if you have managed to get through this whole video, uh, good on you. Thank you for listening. Um, You didn't have to, but you did. So, I would suggest that anything you see in this video that you, you would like to trade maybe the new york nick stickers which i can stick in a plain white envelope um i think i've got these three uh stickers there's a little thing at the end to make it easy you just pull that off and take it off and stick it wherever you want um you know i can stick those in a plain white envelope with a first class stamp on it and mail it out to you. So if you've got like six, because I've got three other New York Knicks stickers somewhere in my cupboard, somewhere. So if you feel like you you want those six uh, New York Knicks stickers, and you want to trade them for Chicago Bulls stickers or Steelers, Pirates or Penguins stickers, um, you know, please leave a comment, like this video. I know the bit my videos aren't too brilliant. Leave a comment and we'll try and do something. Thank you.